You. This fantail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I have never talked to him before, but he's famous, or infamous, throughout the school. Everybody knows of him. <sighs> I wish I could roll my R's. <sighs> You're a Yoko, right? <laughs> How did you know? I know everybody here. Besides, you're the only human, so I mean, it's kind of easy. Single poppy in a field of rye. That rye my dick. Me, right? <laughs> <laughs> you say you were a friend of Sakuya's? Huh, not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class, that is all. I had never have thought that stuck-up aristocratic son of a wannabe was your brother. Like, you Jump. still talk like that, uh, even though you did find out that he was my brother. But, uh, whatever. A aristocrat wannabe? He's an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article. In the flesh. And feathers. He is? He's a bit of a pain. So good luck. Mon ami, adieu. <laughs> he really is a no burler. Mo, <laughs> a mo, nah, he really is a noble bird. <laughs> Loving your female voice. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. So I was are we just going? Are we just going with it? Yes. I'm well, not changing it now. Uh, continuity, man. Continuity. I've never heard anything like that about Yuya, though probably a twisty business, if you know what I mean. Where's a male mallard duck? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Yes. That's all for today. Oh. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! <laughs> huh? Sir, where's Ryota? What the fuck? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there. Now that I'm a better, now that I think about it, Ryota always did have a weak stomach. I shouldn't. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. Give him a little throat massage. Excuse me. <clears throat> <sighs> no birdies here. There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence. There's no birdie here. Ryota? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around that empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryota, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. Oh, <laughs> I was oh, correct. Yeah. Meth head in an abandoned building, <laughs> talking to birds. Right now, he's cur she's currently just going through her the park. <laughs> Trife, Lucio Benizzi. What do these even do? Oh, I'm about to find out. All right, that's the voice we get. <laughs> Here's gonna be mystery, man. <laughs> uh, second, what's your second voice? Yeah. Good. Uh, care to find out, dude? Oh wait, I think it's oh. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor. Well, I mean. Who? <laughs> 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 man, beat me to it. Damn it. Oh, is that is that my name? Is that that is it? Jesse's name. Go for it, Jesse. <laughs> What? I don't know. No, that's that's, 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 that's okay. okay. I'll feed you all sorts of. <laughs> wow, I'm a little airplane mode. Um, yeah. I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, thank you. This partridge in a pear tree is a wamamini shoe. School doctor. He's rather creepy in person and has a bad re bad reputation among the student body. Every birdie knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with syphilis, asparagus, pristacasicosis, or even worse things. Peanut butter AIDS. <laughs> <laughs> and I never even heard him come in the door. Ninja Doctor! Ninja Doctor! <laughs> you don't look like you had a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Uh, I heard Ryuta. Ka la 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 fa la 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 wara. From two three was supposed to be here. Him? Yeah, he's already gone home. <clears throat> Why didn't he come find me before going home? <laughs> Sorry to bother you. What about? I'll be going now. 
Ah, finally out of that den of evil. Evil. Ryuta's already gone home. What do I do now? Ah, oh, I never got around to joining the club last year. <laughs> Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. Where did this come from? <laughs> what <Wow>. a twist! <laughs> I think there are clubs. Um. Whoa. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, or bird watching. Bird watching. What's bird watching? A bird watching? <laughs> See that? Bird mission? watching. Bird watching. See that chick in the locker room? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, oh man. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. Oh. I ran in middle school, and it's always watching for unwatching. Those birdies hop around. I bet it is. <laughs> Why would they have a track team? I think their club room is on the ground floor, off to the side. A white a dove team? is having a tantrum inside, outside. No, I got it. Oh. Coo coo! This is no putting for a man! <laughs> coo! Uncle Sun rejects it! It's a lie! A vicious falsification! He's dancing around on a squish pudding! What? Hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. This. This bitch is Uncle Sun. He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a fantail pigeon. Either way, he's hyper. Coke addict. Not fucking around. Uncle Sana suffered a deception most vile, a wretched betrayal. <laughs> Please start the next line with I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. <laughs> I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. Betrayal! <laughs> Coo! Uncle Sana instructed that pudding be provided for new members. The pudding? Coo! But this is no pudding. It's poo. <laughs> Ousted, scorned, betrayed, dragged into the street and shot by those he trusted most. It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. A travesty! What's wrong with it? <laughs> coo, coo! Spare the jest, young lady! I'm a lady! Oh, oh, my, God. oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> coo! They'll rue the day they crossed Okosan. He'll have them flayed, hanged, shot at dawn. He will. I like think that was his version of bitch life. Two. Uncle Sun was now trained to achieve true pudding. Farewell. Sounds really sexual. <laughs> and like a sexy bird in the night, he's gone. What a man. He's a good runner. <laughs> but what does pudding have to do with the track team? And so ended the first day of my second semester at Saint Pigeonations. Er, I thought, I think we want to choose class council today. As you all know, this school doesn't require you to join any club. If you want, you can. But, no, oh, fuck it. If, if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. <laughs> you need a second? <laughs> you want to stay? I got it. Alright. Coo! Oko-san has time only for the track team! <laughs> That, uh, <laughs> that's that's good. What about you, sure game? <laughs> A foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became a little bitch when you were admitted. <laughs> Nepotism? Ha! Oh, did we get to vote? Just coming to school is enough for me. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. Hmm, I wonder what I should do. Join the... the... Oh. I think we get to make a choice here. <gasps> Yay! Oh my god, a first actual choice. So, next time on Total Exposure Gaming, we will make a choice. Oh my god, what should we do? What will it be? I don't know. We're going to have to discuss. Yeah, we're going to have to vote on this. Yep. Alright guys, next time. Thank you for watching Total Exposure Gaming. Please leave a comment below and subscribe for daily content.